Scallywag Day. For me, true? It is, isn't it? Huh? It is. Uh, mm, you know, my favorite color is blue, right? No, wait, it's yellow. No peeking, Bartleby. You can't see your wuzzle wag until it's finished. Wuzzle wag day rules. Don't you have a wag to decorate? Of course I do. I just, um, you know, haven't started yet. Galloping green, Bartleby. It can take time to get a wuzzle wag decorated just so. Why do we give painted wigs on Wuzzlewag Day anyway? You mean you've never heard the story of the Wuzzle Bun? A Wuzzle Bun? Sounds cuddly. Like Wuzzy Wuzzy Woo. Oh, yes. They were cuddly and magical. You see, a long time ago, Wuzzle Buns roamed free in the Many Covers Meadow. A Wuzzle Bun used its magic to turn ordinary wigs into magical Wuzzle Wigs filled with special treats. What kind of treats? All kinds of wonderful things the Rainbow Kingdom never had before. Grabble apples, marshmallows. And were there fishy poofs? Fishy poofs? Yes, I'm sure that's where fishy poofs came from, Bartleby. But where did all the Wuzzle Buns go? No one has seen a Wuzzle Bun in one million three thousand and seventy-two years. But we still decorate pretend Wuzzle Wigs and give them to our friends on Wuzzle Wig Day to celebrate the magic of the Wuzzle Buns. This year, I'm going to give you the prettiest, most awesome Wuzzle Wig you've ever seen, True. But first, um, I have to find it. <laughs> Good luck, Bee! Ah, the many colors meadow. Smells like spring. Now to find myself the prettiest, most awesome wuzzle wig ever! Huh? Uh, that way, huh? Oh, okay, thanks! Okay, okay, just point. I can follow pointing, you know. No one saw that, right? Oh. oh, my paws. Those pushy plants were right. It's a wig. No, not just any old wig. The biggest wig ever. True's eyes are going to pop out of her head when she sees this. I'm back. I found you the best wag in the universe. You gotta see it to believe it. True, it's amazing! But don't look. You can't see it until it's done. Was a wag day rules! I need paint. Lots of paint. And a brush. <laughs> Aren't you just the best whittle waggy? Ah, oh, Whittle Waggy's so cute. Bartleby loves Waggy. Bartleby can't wait to give Whittle Waggy to best friend True. <laughs> Whoops. Need more paint. Stay right here, Waggy. Be good for Bartleby. I'll be right back. Oh, Bartleby. <laughs> 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 Waggy? 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 Where are you, Waggy? True Rainbow King, come quick! What's wrong? Out of paint already? No! I was working on an amazing wuzzle wig for True, and then I just left for a second, and when I got back, it was gone! Someone, or something, took it! Look at those footprints! They're ginormous! They're pretty big, all right. These tracks should be easy to follow. We'll have the mystery of the missing wag solved in no time. Ooh, I love a good mystery. Ta 
Time to track that Weg Snatcher. We're coming, Weggy. What a weird path. It's like it doesn't know where it's going. Right. It's almost as if it's looking for more Wegs to steal. It all fits. Weg Snatcher gotta snatch Wegs. This is no ordinary thief. It's definitely some kind of extra strong, super sneaky, humongously hairy, big fang, wig stealing monster headed right for. <gasps> Rainbow City! Uh oh. Just look at everyone innocently walking around with their wuzzle wigs. Right out in the open, where the wuzzle wig thief could see them. We have to tell everyone to hide their wigs until this extra strong, super sneaky, humongously hairy, big fanged wig stealing monster. <gasps> Is caught! I'm not sure this is a full scale emergency just yet, Bartleby. True. What do you think? Hmm. The footprints are really big, and Bee's wig did go missing. I guess Bartleby could be right about a wig snatching monster. Oh, I'd hate to spoil Wuzzle Wig Day. But if Bartleby is right, we have to keep everyone and their Wuzzle Wig safe. All right then. It is decided. <clears throat> Attention all Rainbow Kingdom citizens! We have evidence of an unknown wig-stealing monster in the kingdom. Please proceed to hide your wigs in a safe place and gather in the square until further notice. A wig-stealing monster? You heard the king? Hide all the wigs! If this monster is as horrible as Bartleby suspects, we may have to cancel Wuzzle Wig Day altogether. Cancel Wuzzle Wig Day? But Rainbow King, please, you can't cancel it. We're going to find out what happened to Bartleby's wig, and we're going to have Wuzzle Wig Day. <laughs> I knew I could count on you. Good luck, True. Good luck, Bartleby. Okay, Bartleby. We have no more tracks to follow. Monster tracks. Don't forget that they're wig snatching monster tracks. They may be monster tracks. Without maybe monster tracks to follow, the only way we can solve this mystery in time to save Wuzzle Wig Day is with wish help. Oh, Cumulo! <laughs> to the wishing tree, please! wanted to be painted like wuzzle eggs. <laughs> <laughs> you all look fantastic. <laughs> but wuzzle egg day is why we're here. Bartleby had a special wuzzle egg. The best egg ever! And we think it may have been taken. By a super strong giant egg snatching monster with fangs and claws who just stole my perfect egg and took it back to its mystery lair. And we tried to follow it, but the monster tracks disappeared. We don't know that's what happened. Oh, I know. Here. It is true that we saw big footprints, and then they stopped. And we have to solve the mystery, or the Rainbow King might have to... Cancel Wuzzle Egg Day. Hmm. Let's sit and have a think. <sighs> okay, True, how can the Wishing Tree help you? I think... If I may, first. We need to find the Snatcher. Then, we need to steal back the wig. Then, we need to get away real fast. And we need to make it so that they can't steal the wig ever again. Uh, I think what Bartleby is trying to say is that we need to find the wig. And the monster. And bring the wig home so we can save Wuzzle Wig Day. The Wishing Tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me.
those wishes have extra oomph, cause we're gonna need it. Let's check them out in the Wishipedia. The first wish is Scansy, a locator wish. It's my star wish at hide and go seek. Scansy sounds like the perfect wish for finding Bartleby's wag. And the monster. Now, your next wish is... Same, same. One of the best mimic wishes. This wish can copy the sound or voice of anything it meets. Same, same. Really? Like what? Really? Like what? Whoa! 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 Okay, cut it out. Okay, cut it out. No, really. No, really. How do you turn this wish off? How do you turn this wish off? <laughs> okay, same, same. All done. Same, same sounds just like Bartleby. Perfect distraction. We can use same, same to distract the Snatcher while we steal back Weggy from right under its monster nose. If it has a nose. What about our third wish, Z? Craplo, a pickup wish. It can pick up and carry anything. Grapple! Oh. Yes, the perfect wig snatching device. Or, oh, 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 we should just bam, snatch the monster and all its wig snatching friends, yeah, yeah, and move them far, far away from Rainbow Kingdom and save Wuzzle Wig Day. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, B. I'm sure these wishes are just what we need. Zoo zip zap wishes in my pack. <laughs> Missing wag and steal it back. Oh, oh, Gagsy! Aren't you gonna use Scansy? I mean, we've gotta find that monster before it takes my waggy too far away. Let's ask around first. If there was a strange anything wandering around town with the wag, I'm sure somebody noticed. Great idea, True. Let's crack this case wide open. the monster that snatched it. Now, can we use Scansy? Pretty please, with a fishy poof on top? Absolutely. Time for my first wish. monster that looks like this. Scansy! I think Scansy's found something. Let's go into the many colors meadow. Scansy! <gasps> it's Weggy! And the monster's got him! And he's getting away! Waggy, we're coming to rescue you! Monster. Hey! Hey, you! Leave my wag alone, you terrible wag snatching thing, you! Baba Bee? <laughs> Uh oh. Baba Bee! Ah! It's chasing us! Baba Bee! Quick, Scansy! Back in the pack! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry I didn't believe you, Bee. I hate being so. Following 
your voice. I can't help it. I just have one of those deep, irresistible voices. Baba Bee? Ah! I know how to get it to stop chasing us. Time for my second wish. Bartleby's voice so that monster can hear it. No time! It's coming this way! This way! This way! This way! Bye, Bobby! This way! This way! Phew! It worked! Oh, no! We just sent Same Same towards Rainbow City! This way! This way! We have to get there first and warn everyone about the monster! Come on! Again with the running? Well, this is just about the most boring Wuzzlewag day ever. This way! This way! Bartleby? Ah! Reggie, stop! Reggie, stop! Uh, Bartleby? Nobody move! There's an extra strong, super sneaky, humongously hairy, big fanged egg stealing snatcher <laughs> inside that wag! <laughs> Probably the wrong thing to say. Bobblebee! <laughs> Bobblebee! We have to fix this and stop that monster. Ah, uh, nobody, nope, no can do. I'm not going anywhere near that thing. Hmm, maybe you don't have to. Time for my third way. Keep it away from everyone. Oh, yeah. Especially me. Keep it away from Baba B. Baba B. Thanks, Grapplo. Don't let it go until we know what to do with it. <laughs> Where's that beast? I'll take care of it. I'm Kitty Natty Tough. I'm... It's okay, B. Grapplo's got it. Oh. Oh, phew. Excellent job, Grapplo. Make sure you hold that monster nice and tight. Wag Snatcher? But you're so cute and cuddly. Bartleby, this is no Wag Snatcher. It would seem you have found us a Wuzzle Bun. <gasps> <gasps> uh, a real live Wuzzle Bun? Like from the Wuzzle Wag Day story? Indeed. Bartleby. I feel kind of silly now. I told everyone there was an extra strong, super sneaky, humongous, hairy, big fanged egg stealing monster. <laughs> B, it's okay. We all make mistakes. Your imagination told you something was true, but it wasn't. But I didn't even get you a wuzzle wag like I promised, True. Bartleby, the wuzzle wag you got for me had a wuzzle bun inside it. So I. Didn't ruin Wuzzle Wake Day? Quite the opposite. You made this the most special one ever. <laughs> I didn't ruin Wuzzle Wake Day! Ah, oh, Waggy! Baba Bee! What just happened? Wuzzle Bun magic. I suggest you all check inside your wuzzle wigs. Sparkles! <laughs> 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 you did that? <laughs> 
Wow. I wish you could come every Wuzzlewag day. Jumping jelly green, Bartleby. <laughs> what a wonderful idea. <clears throat> from this moment on, we will celebrate Wuzzlewag Day with a visit from our new friend, the Wuzzlebun. And hide our wigs because it was so much fun. <laughs> Wishes. Now back in the pack. <laughs> we did it, Bee. We solved the mystery and found your wig and the monster. <laughs> <laughs> All in time to say Wuzzle Wig Day. Best day ever! Even if you're the only one without a magic Wuzzle Wig? Day, Bartleby. You painted fishy poofs on it? And me and you? It's perfect. Thanks, Drew. Thanks, Waggy. <laughs> huh? <gasps> Extra special marshmallow fishy poofs. Oh. Uh huh. Thanks, Waggy. Happy Wuzzle Wag Day. And see you next year. Bye, Bobby. Pinotari Hullabaloo! Bye, 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 Bye. Bartleby, look! It's starting! Everyone's on their way to the Funda Wanda Festival! Ooh, I'm so excited! Me too! How many events are we gonna go to? How many? All of them. The pie eating contest, the Yeti Stomp Dance contest, the Rainbow City Bus Toot Salute. They all asked me to be a judge today. Wow, that sounds like a lot of stuff to do. Yeah, but I love to do a lot and help a lot. <laughs> and giggly green morning to you, True and Bartleby. Join us in celebrating all that makes Rainbow Kingdom fun and wonderful. Funda Wonder! Funda Wonder! Funda Wonder! <laughs> oh, I brought a special surprise for this year's festival. A Hinotari egg. The Hinotari mama bird lays only one egg every thousand years. What a nice thing to share with us for the Funda Wanda Festival. Oh, and speaking of the festival, True, I am a bit concerned about all the royal functions I must attend to while watching the egg. I can watch the egg for you while you do all your Funda Wanda kingly duties. Really? Why, thank you, True. <laughs> You're always so helpful. <laughs> oh, how cute. Ah, uh, True. Aren't you already busy with a bunch of events today, kind of? I am, but I can do all that and watch the egg. No problem. Thank you, True. Enjoy the Funda Wonder Festival. <laughs> yeah, the egg is, well, an egg. But this ice cream cone is amazement. True, check out my multi-flavored Mega Scoop Monster Cone. <laughs> Five second roll. But mm, two. <laughs> <gasps> That's my first event. The Rainbow City Bus Toot Salute. Mm. On your way, Judge True. Have fun. Mm. Uh oh, Eggie doesn't seem to like loud noises. I got this. You go honk it up with the buses, and I'll tootle around with Eggie here. Thanks, B. I'll be back soon. Ah, cat's work is never done. Who's my Eggie? You're my Eggie. Yeah. Oh, hello, True. Are you ready to judge the toot salute? <laughs> oh, where's the Hinotari egg? Aggie doesn't like loud noises, Your Highness. So Bartleby's watching it until I get back. Ah, good thinking. All right, buses, let's hear those toots. Nice! particularly comfortable with kitty cats. It's obvious the calming effect of a nurturing kitty cat. Hey, Bee. <coughs> How's Eggie doing? Over easy. <laughs> Just that, that 
that's an egg joke. It means Eggie's fine. <laughs> oh, good. I guess I didn't have to scramble back. <laughs> oh, look at that scramble back. <laughs> good one. Hi. The Yeti Storm Dance Contest must be starting now. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. More loud noise? Poor Eggie. Egg sitting. Thanks, B. Back soon. Eggy, want a balloon? <laughs> Maybe we'll just pick a couple to tie around you. Oh, this one looks nice. No, no. Huh? Oh, look at that. That's incredible. Look at the oh. colors on that one. That's a. Oh, oh, wait a minute. That one. No, no. How about those two? Wait. Mm -mm. Mama? Maybe those ones. There. Yeah. Hold on. Balloons are floaty. What if they carried Eggy away? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what am I worried about? It's not like you're gonna... <gasps> Hatch and run away! Oh, no. now. Um, Hatcher! Where are you? I've got balloons! Hatcher! Oh, that chick could be a million miles away by now. You know what to do, Rocky. <laughs> Step right up mm -hmm. and win a prize. Can you guess if this is a rock or a rock critter? Make the right guess and the prize is yours. Hmm. Rock Critter. Nope. Rock. Oh. Rock Critter? Awesome! Congratulations! Yay! Um, Miss True, uh, ma'am? The pie-eating contest. I forgot about that one, too. I really need to get back to Bee Soon. Boy, you love corn, huh? <laughs> That's great. Hey! <laughs> no tickling my nose now. <laughs> that was a tickle, I think. Nice red tail feather, by the way. Mama? Mama? No, 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 no. Stay put, little Hatcher, okay? While we go find True. Hatcher? Oh, no, 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 Hatcher! Hey, <laughs> What's wrong? Um, funny story. Um, <gasps> the egg? It hatched? Yeah, just a little. Okay, a lot. It hatched a lot! And it ran away! Oh, no! I should have come back sooner! The Rainbow King is counting on me! We have to get Eggy back! I call her Hatcher now, you know, since she hatched and everything. <sighs> I promised to help out on too many things today, B, but I couldn't keep up. I should have never taken on the exiting job. And now this happened. I'm sorry. No big deal, True. Everyone knows how much you want to help, and I'm here to help you. Thanks, B. You're the best. Now let's go find Eggy. Uh, I mean, Hatcher. <laughs> She went that way. Hatcher! What a sweet little chickie. Mama? Oh, she thinks I'm her mama. Did you see that? A kiss from Hatcher? Turns people into chicks. We've, We've got to stop, stop this. this. Follow that chick. Hatcher's speedy. You should see how fast she ate a cob of corn. She likes corn? Quick, B, grab one. Oh, Hatcher, over here. I have lots of yummy, yummy corn. <laughs> oh, greetings, Hinotari chick. <laughs> Hinotari chick. Oh, my. <laughs> oh. 
Hi. Mm. You okay, little fella? Meow, <laughs> True, <gasps> Bartleby. The Hinotari chick has hatched. We know, we know. We're trying to find her. But we must do it soon. Until the Hinotari chick gets a kiss from its mother, it will keep kissing citizens. It, it will? will? Yes. And then it won't be long until everyone is turned into a chick. <gasps> Not to worry. Fortunately, I know the best way to catch a Hinotari chick. It's as simple as... Rewriting! What is going on around here? I came to the Fundawana Festival to have fun. If something bad is happening, keep it away from me. Actress <laughs> searching for her mama, and she's kissing everyone in sight until she finds her. Well, we'd better reunite them fast. One Hinotari chick is cute, but a whole town full? Come on. We need some big time wish help. Oh, Cumulo! <laughs> We're celebrating the Funda Wanda Festival by playing our own games in the wishing tree. Right now, they're about to do a sack race. I'll be the judge at this event. On your mark, get set, go wishes! Don't worry. We'll play a lot of games so that you can all get a ribbon. Now, how can the wishing tree help you, True? We have a problem, Z. The Hinotari chick hatched, and now the chick is kissing everyone and turning them into chicks. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Even worse, it's going to keep happening until we get her back to the top of Mount Tippy Tippy Top to get a kiss, kiss from her mom. mom. Great gravity. What a dilemma. Let's sit and have a think about this. How do you plan to fix this problem? Well, I need a wish to help me bring all the chicks together so I can pick out the real one. Sounds good. Any other ideas? I'll need another wish to help me change them all back again. Good thinking. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes. Wikipedia says about them. Hmm. Oh, here it is. Your first wish is Tizway, a musical wish that plays music so enchanting that everyone wants to follow the wish around. That's handy. The chicks can follow Tizway's music so I can get them all together in one place. <laughs> Your second wish is... Tintly. Ooh, how bold. This color wish can change the color of any object, anywhere. Hatcher likes corn. Maybe I could color the egg stroller yellow. Then Hatcher will hop back into it. The stroller could look like a big, juicy corn niblet. <laughs> <laughs> and lastly, you have Flecto. Flecto can not only show reflections in its mirror, but he can make himself bigger and smaller as well. I'm not sure how a mirror can help us round up all the chicks. <laughs> but I'll find some way for it to help. You always do. 
Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Okay, that's not on the same page, no. I'll herd them all together with some music. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Tisway! Wish come true! Tisway, do you know a song that these chicks might like? Uh-huh! Great, let's hear it. Hey, it's working! But won't they just run around again? You know, when the music stops? Not if we round them up and put them somewhere. And I know just the place. Let's go! Yay! Yay! Up to left, right, here we go. Okay, we've got all the chicks. Uh, but there's so many of them. Now what? Well, if we can get up a bit higher and get a better look, then maybe we can pick out the right chick. Thanks, Tisway. Great job. <laughs> Go Cumulo! Hmm. <gasps> the real one's hard to pick out. They all look the same. Yeah, they all have those big, dewy eyes and cute little tails with that one little red feather. One little red feather? Yeah, just like the one Hatcher tickled my nose with. Um, B, I only see one red feather. <laughs> that must be Hatcher! Yay, B! <laughs> <laughs> oh, The chicks are on the loose again. We need something to get their attention. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Like a... <gasps> a big cob of corn. What? Sazumi juice balls. Ta-da! One big kitty corn cob. But it's purple. At least it's easy to move in. Whoa! <laughs> Spoke too soon. I mean, just have to get used to it. And my second wish can help us with the color part. Zip zap zoo, I too oh! Wake up, Tisley! <laughs> wish comes true! Hi, Tintley. I need to make Barbie's disguise yellow. Just enough to make him corny. Do you think you can help? Uh-huh. Oh. Super corny. I really am. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> Thanks, Tinsley. <laughs> Let's round them up again. Here, chicky chickies. I have a giant cup of corn for you. Why don't they want my delicious corn body, True? Try acting more like corn. Act more like corn? What does she mean by that? Oh, okay, here goes. <laughs> Corn, 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 I'm a corn on the cob. Corn, 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 doing such a great um job. There, that rhymed. It's working. Too well. Run! Keep going, B. Back to where we heard it before. Yeah, I'm running as fast as I can. <sighs> I didn't make it! Bartleby! Oh, my poor little chicky chicky! Uh-oh! Cumulo! Hurry! Phew! Thanks, Cumulo! 
Milo. <laughs> but now that I've lost Bartleby, I'm the only one left who isn't a baby bird. <laughs> Whoa, Griselda, you changed back? True. I do not know what's going on here. <laughs> Ooh. But you better... Ooh. The puddle! Ooh. That's it! When the chick saw its reflection in the puddle, it changed back into Griselda. It would be a lot faster to use my mirror wish to change all the chicks back. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Change everyone back? Mm hmm. Great. Let's go. Hi there. Who's this cute little face I see? Huh? Hey, it works. Thanks, True. Why do I have this urge to eat corn on the cob? Hi. Hello. Hey, thanks. Wait, come back, chickies. <sighs> This would be much easier with a bigger mirror. <gasps> Flecto, I need you to be bigger so every chicky can see itself. <laughs> Thanks. Let's roll. Look <laughs> 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 over here, please, chicky. Purple persimmons. I'm a king again. Here, chick, chick, chick. <laughs> Silky cat self again. True. I'm so glad you're back, You were the last one. Everybody's back to being themselves again. Sweet. But where's Hatcher? Right here. <laughs> we must get her to her mama on Mount Tippy Tippy Top before she kisses anyone else. There's no time to waste. Oh, Mama Hino Terry Bird, oh. we brought you a little something from the festival. Oh, Mama! Oh. <laughs> wow. Do you think it worked? Only one way to find out. May I? <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. And me. Thanks! <laughs> <laughs> the Kitty Natty. Front paw! Purple! <laughs> that means I have to reach way over there! <laughs> is that. It is impossible. What is it, Bee? It's a message mouse. A message mouse? <gasps> Whoa! It must have a secret message for me. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> You've been Bartleby'd. Huh? <laughs> gotcha! Ta-da! What's the message? Who's it from? Only the most secret group ever. The Kitty Natty. The Kitty Whatty? The Kitty Natty. <gasps> Master Bartleby, the Kitty Natty requests your presence. Please follow this message mouse to the Black Tabby Dojo. Let's get a giddy up, True. Slow down, Bartleby. Can't lose it now. Gotta get to the dojo. What's a dojo? It's a place for kitty cats to train and become stealth ninjas. Hi-ya, hoo ha Whoa! <laughs> and I tripped. You're gonna be a ninja cat? Yeah, well, you know, I already am. Well, uh, a teeny bit. I only have my yellow tabby belt. That means I'm just a beginner. Now I can finally go for my red tabby belt, no matter how long it takes. It takes a long time? Does that mean... You'll be gone for a long time? 
Look, I'll come back with cool new ninja moves. You know, like hi -ya and meow and <laughs> like that. Yeah, okay. Those moves are pretty cool. <laughs> <gasps> oh, no. We lost the message mouse. No, no, no. We didn't lose it. We're here. I'm True, and you know Bartleby. I am Shadow. Ah. I am Silverclaw. Welcome to the Black Tabby Dojo. Whoa! Red Tabby Belt, Red Tabby Belt's gonna get the Red Tabby Belt. If you pass our many, many tests. Until then, please say goodbye to your friend. Oh, right. I'll miss you, True. I'll miss you too, B. But I know you'll do great. Goodbye, friend. See you soon. This river. I'm waiting for my friend Bartleby. He's gonna be a while. He's in ninja cat training. The Black Tabby Dojo is where the Kitty Natty master their strength, balance, and focus. Our training stations await you. The Kitty Lati have no fear. We live in shadow, we disappear. Ah! Our perfect balance is no trick. You must be careful, those birds prick. That's my backside. Nothing can distract our mind. <laughs> perfect focus hard to find. Learn from us, young Bartleby, and soon you'll be a kitty Nazi. I did it! I did a tail pull! Did you see that? I did one! Me! Now pull yourself up. <sighs> Does almost stop count? No! <laughs> I'm okay. I'm okay. Pretty sure I'm okay. Again. <gasps> hop, little acorn, one, two, three. Hop, little acorn, hop to me. Hop, little acorn, one, two, three. Hop, little acorn, hop to me. Water is not supposed to do that. What is it? What's wrong? Oh no, your home is full of water. Don't worry, little friend. We'll get to the bottom of this. I gotta keep my focus. <laughs> Stay focused, Bartleby. Come on. Something is not right in the forest. I will investigate. Again. Hurry, everybody! Where is all this water coming from? That hill looks like it's going to... Whoa! Geyser! I have to stop it from gushing before everything floods. This log uh, is too, too heavy. Ooh, this mushroom might plug it. <laughs> there. Oh, no! <laughs> Flying mushroom. Unusual. <laughs> <laughs>
Congratulations, Master Bartleby. You have discovered many new ways to fall down. That was the mushroom's fault. Again. <laughs> Mushroom flies back. Very unusual. <laughs> well, that didn't work. I can't fix this on my own. I need to get some help from the wishing tree. Cumulo, over here. <laughs> to the wishing tree, please. <gasps> Where's True going? I hope she's okay. <gasps> ah! Oh, my uh, shadow. <laughs> hey, uh, I have to go. Um, check on someone, something outside the dojo. You are free to leave any time. But once you go, you cannot return. The Black Tabby Dojo will disappear the moment you leave it. No dojo? No. No red tabby belt? No. Oh. Um, well, um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm sure everything is fine. I'm, I'm just probably just worrying too much. Yep, that's what I'm probably doing. I'm just probably worrying too much. <laughs> I am testing some Wish's musical abilities. Go ahead, try it. Bravo! Thanks, Wishes. We can play more later. Uh, where is Bartleby today? Um, he's with some forest friends training for um cat stuff. <gasps> you mean the kitty natty? You know about the kitty natty? The ancient tribe of cat ninjas as old as history itself? Of course. That's actually why I'm here. The river outside of their dojo was rising and flooding forest creatures out of their homes. I'm sure we can find a solution. Let's sit and think. <gasps> this sounds serious. It is. I was lying by the river, not far from their dojo. Then all of a sudden, boosh, a huge geyser of water blasted all over. Fascinating. The water is spraying everywhere, so I need a wish to stop it. Then I need to figure out where all the water is coming from. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Selections. Let's look them up in the Wishopedia. Your first wish is Grozer. Oh, yes. Interesting. What? Tell me. It can make any vegetation grow larger. Veggie what? Tation who? You know, greenery. Like vegetables and plants. Ooh, there are lots of plants in the forest. I could grow one larger to plug the geyser. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> now your second wish is Bubba. Oh, listen to this. It's a swimming wish that lets you breathe underwater. That's perfect. If I'm going to find out what's causing the flood, I'll be glad to have Bubba with me. And your last wish is 
Hushabai, a musical wish. It can play a wide selection of soothing songs. Cool. But I'm not sure anyone's going to need to take a nap. Maybe you can use it for yourself after. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Z. Come on, wishes. Let's go stop the fly. <laughs> We are Kitty Nutty. We do not giggle while training. Huh? We are Kitty Nutty. We do not purr while training. <laughs> right. No purring, no giggling. Super. True! True! Look at me! <laughs> Again. The guys are still gushing water. Okay, Grozer, are you ready? Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Grozer! Wish come true! Can you make a mushroom big enough to plug the geyser like a cork in a bottle? Uh-huh. Then grow, grow, grow! <laughs> Uh-oh! Here comes more water! <sighs> it worked! Thanks, Grozer! <laughs> We've stopped the water above ground, but it's still flooding your home underground. Don't worry. I'll find out where the water is coming from. What is he doing? <sighs> he has been weakened by the power of the feather. What news of the forest? The girl named True is working to solve a problem involving water. True? You mean my True? Isn't she great? Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I have no idea how. I, I don't even like feathers. Until I can figure out how to stop the water from flooding your home, I hope the snuggly spot will do. <laughs> oh, no! Mini geysers? Lots of them? And they're headed for the dojo. I've got to warn Bartleby. I'm invisible. Can you see me? Yes. Be like shadow. Think like shadow. Got it. How about now? Ah, water! I'm wet. I'm wet everywhere. Towel! <laughs> Thank you! How did you know I was in trouble? I saw many geysers heading towards the dojo. But you can stop them, right? I mean, you brought some wishes, right? Of course! But I'm coming with you. Bartleby, we must remind you, if you leave this dojo, you cannot return. I know, but I have to help my friend. Come from. The ground got rumbly, and then my feet got tumbly, and then the river started rising. The river! Bartleby, that's it. If the river water is rising, maybe there's a problem in the river. If I can go underwater, I can find the solution. But true, you can't go into the river. I can with some wish help. Bubba, I need you. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Bubba! Wish come true! Good 
good day for a swim, Bubba. Hmm, looks like all the river water is under that hill. Which the big geyser is sitting on. But why is the river water rising so fast? Let's go back that way. There, look! A puppy puff's in trouble. And it's blocking the river's other path. Excuse me, Mr. Puffy Puff, but you're blocking one of the river's paths. Are you stuck? Can I please unstick you? It's okay. I didn't mean to scare you. Aw, you are scared, aren't you? Aw, I'll bet when you get scared, you get puffy. Am I right? Hmm, so to get you to unpuff, I'll need to calm you down. <gasps> My third wish! Hushabye! Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Hushabye! Wish come true! <laughs> we need some relaxing music, Hushabye. Can you do it? <laughs> you still look a little worried. Let me sing you a song. Hush a hush a hush a bye, don't be afraid. No need to cry, hush a hush a bye. Think sweet thoughts, then close your eyes. Go to sleep, hush a hush a bye. Swim free, Mr. Puffy Puff. And the river's flowing again. You did it, hush a bye. Thank you. Time to go back in the pack. Come on, Bubba. Let's go see if the mini geysers have stopped. Ugh. Ugh. Huh? Huh? Whoa! Oh no! The water's too fast! Help! I'm floating away! True? True! Just your tail? You mean I was just like the kid in Addy Masters? Yes, you were. We saw everything. You did? I'm... I'm sorry I left my training at the dojo, but I had to help True. And if that means I can't... Huh? You made the right choice, Bartleby. Indeed. You did what Kitty Natty are trained to do. You focused your mind and body to help those in need. And it is our opinion that you have earned a red tabby belt. A red tabby belt? Meow! That's the most amazing thing ever! Way to go, me! Way to go, me! Way to go... <clears throat> I'm... <clears throat> <laughs> Bartleby. Now you are a true Kitty Natty red belt. Thank you, O oh Masters of Kitty Natty. Your true friend is waiting. Look, True! I'm a red tabby kitty! <laughs> no one saw that, right? We're all good? Okay. Come on, True. Let's go play. 
<laughs> Ninja Cat or not, you're still the Bartleby I know and love. the best way to cool off on a hot day at the beach. Just don't get brain freeze. How can my brain freeze when my head's so nice and warm, True? <laughs> brain freeze is what it feels like when you drink cold drinks too fast. So sip it slowly. <laughs> brain, brain freeze! freeze. <sighs> Body freeze! Paw freeze! Tail freeze! Tail freeze, you anyone? I got it, babe! <laughs> Good, fantastic. <laughs> I'll go see if Rainbow King and his guards want some. It needs a grand entrance where I can welcome my visitors and plenty of windows to see the kingdom from. Oh, and don't forget the balcony. Oh. That's where I address my citizens. Oh, oh. There see your majesty? Ah, oh, yes, thank you, True. My castle builders could use a break. Ice cold Zazuni juice. Oh. Oh. Don't drink it too fast, or else you'll get oh. brain freeze. <laughs> oh, a royal brain freeze. Oh, very refreshing. <laughs> so, what do you think? Does my sand castle look like my real rainbow castle? <laughs> Whoa! I can hardly tell them apart. Uh, what? Bartleby, did you finish the rest of the juice? <laughs> huh? What, me? No! What? Did I? Wait, let, let me check. No shivers, no chills, no brain freeze. Nope, wasn't me. Oh, hey, hey! <gasps> A sea blob? Oh, you're so cute! Did you drink all our juice? <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. I bet you just wanted to cool off a bit. <coughs> then let's go for a swim! <coughs> yeah, this shade sure does the trick. A sea blob that doesn't want to go in the sea? That's not sea blobby at all. Whoa! I almost got blubbed big time! This is most unusual. Sea blubs hardly ever leave the water. Hmm. <gasps> the water's not cool at all. It's warm. Really warm. They're just trying to cool off in the shade. Maybe something's wrong with the living sea. Well then, we'd better check on it. Follow me. Come on, Barbie! Huh? Living sea? Oh, yes, we go way back. I knew it when it was just a little puddle. <laughs> oh, wide and wonderful living sea, I ask that you please meet with me. Whoa. Rainbow King, how good to see you. These are my friends, True and Bartleby. They're very eager to meet you. The pleasure is all mine. The living sea doesn't look very lively today. If you don't mind me asking, um, your wetness, are you feeling okay? The heat, it makes me sleepy. Heat makes me sleepy too. The living sea must be part cat. But your water is always cold, even on hot days. That is correct. A family of ice stars keep me nice and cool. Ice stars? Yes, they keep the living sea cool. Just like the ice cubes in Bartleby's Zazuni juice. They really do. <laughs> <laughs> you can find them out in the deep water. But I am not feeling them today. Shocking pink! If something happened to the ice stars... Then the living sea would get warm. Too warm for the sea creatures to live in. We'll go and check on the ice stars right away. Oh. 
That would be most appreciated. You're welcome. We're gonna need a blubber sitter soon. Our poor sea friends. I must try and cool them down. Good idea, Your Majesty. And while you do that, Bertleby and I will find the ice stars. Mm -hmm. Oh, Cumulo! <laughs> Hi, Cumulo. Let's fly out over the deep water of the living sea, please. Bye-bye. Water, water everywhere! The living sea should really be called the mega gigantic humongous sea. I guess your point is it's a really big sea. <laughs> huh? Hey, but I do see a couple of sailboats. <gasps> Those aren't sailboats. They must be ice stars. What do you think would happen if I lick one? <laughs> you probably get the biggest brain freeze ever. <laughs> <laughs> they should be making the water cold. Are these ice stars working okay? I'll just give them my cat's paw test. Brr! Paw freeze again! Meow. Hey, but didn't the Living Sea say there was a whole family of ice stars? Hmm. It is a big sea. Let's keep looking. That's it. A gentle breeze will cool you off. Huh? No. Careful now. There's enough shade for everyone. Oh, my. Now there's no shade for anyone. Oh. Are you all right, my little sea blob? <laughs> well, that was lucky. <laughs> We're going to have to find a new way to keep you shady and cool. <laughs> hmm. That gives me an idea. No ice stars this way. No ice stars that way. No ice stars every which way. Whoa, get, getting dizzy. I might. Oh, oh. I've got you, B. Phew. Wait, I see one. Oh no, this is the ice star from earlier. I can see your paw print. Yeah, right. Wait a minute, there were two ice stars here before. Where'd the other one go? I don't know. We've looked everywhere and we still didn't find the other ice stars. And now we've even lost one. We need to figure this out and fast. Time for some wish help. Cumulo, to the wishing tree, please. True, Bartleby, over here. Fern, engage blowing. <laughs> That's a fun way to keep cool. Fun and useful. I'm preparing the wishes for all types of weather. Windy weather, freezing weather, and sunny weather. Oh, so they'll be ready for all kinds of weather when they go out into the Raider <laughs> Kingdom with me. Exactly. That one's getting used to the cold. Don't get brain freeze. Oh, well, it passes. And this wish is getting used to hot, sunny days. Uh-oh, look out! Whoa! Whoa! I gotcha! <laughs> you okay, little buddy? Are you here to cool off, too? Actually, Z, we have to cool off the whole living sea. The ice stars are missing. Oh, no. So the living sea is getting warmer. The sea blobs are leaving the sea to cool off on the beach. That is serious. Let's have a think about this. We've been all over the living sea looking for the ice stars. But we couldn't find them. So maybe they went under the sea for some reason. That's very possible. So we need a wish to help us search underwater. And then we need to make sure the living sea stays cool until we can get the ice stars back on the job. Good thinking, Drew. You've got a plan and you're ready to do it. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me.
group of wishes. Let's see what the Wishopedia says about their powers. Your first wish is... Chillsy. It is a freeze wish that blasts super cold beams to flash freeze anything. That's perfect! It'll help us cool down the living sea until we can find the missing ice stars. Are you up for chilling the sea, Chillsy? That's a yes! But keep my tail out of this. Hasn't it shivered enough today? Oh. <laughs> Your next wish is... Bubba. It's an underwater wish that can help you breathe underwater too. We've already searched above the sea. To search under it, we'll need all the help we can get. Yeah, the only time this cat touches water is if I'm out of Zazuni juice to drink. Yeah, no offense. <laughs> <laughs> For your last wish, you have... Womping. It's a stomping wish. Nothing makes it happier than womping and stomping. I don't know how a stomping wish will help us find ice stars, but I'm glad to have you on board. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Good luck, True Mortal Bee. Thanks, Z. There's a new sandcastle on the beach, and this one's even bigger! It looks like the Rainbow King found a way to cool off the sea blubs! <laughs> yes, I'm delighted that they're finally comfortable now. But if the living sea doesn't cool down soon, it's going to get very crowded in there. We haven't found the ice stars yet, Your Majesty. But we have our three wishes to help us. Let's go, Cumulo. <laughs> I'd know my paw print anywhere. Poor Ice Star. Cooling the living sea all by yourself. We've brought you some help. Ooh. All right, Chillsy. It's time to chill the living sea. Zip, zap, zoo, I trust you! Wake up, Chillsy! Wish come true! Hi, Chillsy. Let's see how far you can ice things over. <laughs> Great job, Chelsea. You can chill out now from all your chilling. Come on. Come on. Oh, so much better. <sighs> Thank you for the chill, True. You're welcome, Living Sea. But you're so big, we can't freeze all of you. It helps quite a bit. But without my ice stars, I cannot stay cool. We'll find the rest of the ice star family. I promise! <sighs> Cumulo, you keep looking for ice stars above the living sea while Bartleby and I look under it. Or, just thinking out loud here, Cumulo and I could stay up here. No soggy, drippy kitty that way. <laughs> oh, no, catch the cat again! <laughs> ah, tail freeze again? Are you kidding me? I am not having a good tail day. Ah. Aww, another sea flub. I bet you want to be in the colder water here. Hey! Ah! 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 Careful! We just made that ice! Aw, and I guess you want someone to play with, too. Why, oh, why do other creatures find me so irresistible? You are pretty cuddly, Beef. Why don't you keep little Blubby company while I go see if the missing ice stars are underwater? Bubba, time to do your stuff! Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Bubba! Wish come true! Hi, Bubba. Let's go under the sea. Good luck, True! Aw, don't worry, Ice Star. I'll find the rest of your family. A rope? 
What's a rope doing under the sea? <gasps> the ice star's being pulled away! Someone's taking it! Isn't this better than jumping around and cracking all the ice? <laughs> Do I look like a ball here? Put me down. Uh-oh. I forgot to say gently. Oh, look. The last ice star is leaving. The last ice star is leaving? That's bad. About. Ninja kitties can jump from my slow to ice flow, right? One, two, ninja cat, go! Hiya! Ha! 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 Two! Must stay dry! Must stay dry! Must stay dry! Huh? You're dry! Ugh. Oh, true! Thank you, thank you, thank you! I hug you, but, well, you have a big Baba helmet on. It's awkward. We'll have a big hug later, B. Okay. Right now, we have an ice star to catch. Cumulo! <gasps> did you find any more ice stars, Cumulo? Mm -hmm. Neither did I, but I know what's going on now. The missing ice stars didn't sink or float away. They're being taken away. Taken? Why would someone want to take an ice star? I'm not sure. That's what we're going to find out. Bubba, thanks for helping me underwater. <laughs> I know the ice star went this way, but I don't see it anymore. Hey, maybe my sea blood buddy saw it. <laughs> yes! Follow that pointing flipper. Look, there's a clue. A raft and some paddles, and they're still wet. This must be where they brought the ice star. <laughs> well, something's making it cold around here. Do you hear that? <laughs> the ice stars! They're all here! They are! <laughs> Me, <-yow! laughs> Um, excuse me? It's okay. We didn't mean to startle you. I'm True, and this is Bartleby. They're wondering how we found their cove, and I'm wondering how I know that. Bartleby, you speak rockish? <laughs> well, a little. I mean, you know, cats are very good talkers. We followed you here. Are you the ones who moved the ice stars? They say they brought the ice stars here to cool down their home. They really like to play on the ice. But the ice stars belong in the living sea. Without them, it's too warm for the creatures who live in the water. <laughs> they say they're sorry. They just wanted to freeze the lagoon and go skating. They didn't know they were warming up the living sea. <laughs> But they sure cooled things down in here. All the ice stars in one spot might be too much, Chill. We have to move the ice stars out of here. Come on, everyone. All right, everyone, get ready. And pull! It's frozen solid. <laughs> we'll never get the ice stars out of here until things warm up again. And we only have one wish left, Womp It. How can a stomping wish help us warm up the canyon? Hmm. Wait. Maybe we don't need warmth. When the living sea was frozen, do you remember how the sea blub bounced on the ice and cracked it? Yeah, and then I almost got wet. Oh, yeah. Cats, don't forget stuff like that. Wompit could do the same thing. Uh. It can stomp and stomp until all the ice breaks. Then the ice stars will be free and we can get them out of here. I am stupid yeah! with joy at this idea! Time for some wish help. Zip-zap-zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Wompit! Ah! 
wish come true! Okay, Wompit. Ready to stomp it? Let's get stomping! With the Wompit Bam Slam, we're jumping up and down! With the Wompit Bam Slam, we're stomping all around! With the Wompit Bam Slam, can you hear that sound? It's the Wompit Bam Slam of our big feet on the ground! Whoa! Jumping up, jumping down! Pause her up, pause her down! Huge hop, Wompit Bob! Keep on going, don't you stop! With the Wompit Bam Slam, all smiles on a frown! With the Wompit Bam Slam, we're breaking it down! With the Wompit Bam Slam, was there ever any doubt? That jumping up and down is what Wompit's all about! <laughs> our Wompit Stomping did it! All the icers are free! Time to get the Ice Star family back home to the living sea. How does the water feel now? Blop, blop. All nice and cool again. <laughs> <laughs> When winter comes and my surface is frozen, the rock creatures are welcome to come skating on me, True. Thank you, Living Sea. Did you hear that? Oh, it is such a relief to feel cool again. I feel a wave coming on. Whoa! <laughs> Bartleby, I thought cats and water don't mix. <laughs> they don't. Cool. The sea bugs got me covered. Whoa! They keep me nice and dry. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> For now. <Whoa! laughs> Big mossy mess. Okay, Bartleby. If you were the Rainbow King, where would you want to set up my nibbles and zips party? So many choices. Um, uh, let's see. Um, here. <laughs> Bartleby. <laughs> what? This is the perfect spot. It's where all the snack action is. Wow. Getting ready for a juice party with the king sure is making me... Thirsty? Then it's time for a sip of sweet, sweet Suzuni juice. Nectar of the gods. After you. <laughs> Excuse me. Oops. Sorry, was that the last one? <gasps> you just gave me a great idea. Do you want to use a straw like a pretend mustache? <laughs> no, silly. We can get some freshly squeezed Zazuni juice for the Rainbow King. And I know just where to get it. Yeah! Nibbles and sips, nibbles and sips. No quibbles or squabbles. We'll slurp and we'll gobble. Each crumb and each drip of those nibbles and sips. <laughs> Rainbow Guard! <laughs> I'm feeling nibbly and silly. What time does True's party start? Hmm. At 3 p.m. Lavender luck. Mm -hmm. That gives me plenty of time to get ready. Rainbow Guard, uh -huh. please polish my scepter for me. Oh, 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 oh. While I practice my nibbling and sipping. There it is. Happy Farming Valley. And there's a Zuni Moss Island. These islands are so beautiful. Well, hi there, True and Bartleby. Hi, Farmer Mosser. We're having a nibbles and sips party for the Rainbow King today, and we were wondering if we could have some... Fresh squeezed Zazuni juice? Wow. How did you know? That's why everyone comes to Zazuni Moss Island. It's like he can read minds. I am very impressed by this farmer. <laughs> the zingy goodness of Zazuni juice comes from the Zazuni moss we grow right here in our fields. Ah, oh, this is so... Whoa! Soft Zazuni moss. So cozy. So very softy soft. Can Zazuni moss grow anywhere, Farmer Mosser? We can only grow it on this island because it grows so fast. Watch. That is fast. Now I'll show you how this mass gets juiced. Bartleby, <laughs> come on, you silly sleepyhead. Huh? What? Oh, I'm right. Ah, uh, just one more second. Okay. Okay, 
I really have to stop now. And here we have our Zazuni juicer. Wow, that juicer is humongous! The Zazuni mass is scooped up and then dropped into the juicer. It squishes and stretches the mass and then twists it to squeeze all the juice out. Amazing! Is it Zazuni juice yet? Almost. Almost? And there it is. Freshly squeezed Zazuni juice. Enjoy. Perfect. Take as many as you like for your nibble and uh, uh, sip a thing. Wow. Thanks, Thanks Farmer Mosser. Anytime. Bye bye now. Huh? You don't belong there, Moss. Bartleby, come on. I'll be right with you. I should probably give this back to Farmer Mosser. Farmer Mosser! Farmer Mosser! Farmer Mosser! Farmer Mosser! <laughs> oh well, guess I'll just have to hold on to this very soft piece of moss. Super soft, soft moss of ultimate softness. Wow, so soft. All settled? Ah, oh, you bet, yeah. <laughs> a long ride. I could really use a nap. Come on, Bartleby. The king's gonna be here any minute. Uh, fine. <laughs> okay, Moss. You just stay here until I can come back and nap on you. I'll take you back home later. Sleep tight. One last thing. Can you help me set the table, please? I sure can. You take the nibbles and I'll take the sips. Whoa! Is everything okay? Um, yes. I, I um, well, just see a spot that needs cleaning. But I'm on it. sort of brought a teeny tiny bit of it home with me. <laughs> yes, I did that. Teeny tiny? Well, it was teeny tiny when I got it, um, but it's not so teeny tiny now. Oh, right. Farmer Mosser told us that the moss grows really, really fast. Remember? Uh-oh, I think I slept through that part. Did I mention how wonderfully soft that moss was? <laughs> a few times. But on the bright side, now the whole house can be my bed. I'm always just seconds away from a full-on nap. Anywhere, anytime, any place. Everywhere, every time, every place. I can sleep or have a snooze on a lamp or on some boots. On a table or door, on the fridge or on the floor. Toadstool table, that's for me. The list is endless, can't you see? a great song, Bee, but look how much moss grew while you were singing. It'll be hard to have a nibbles and sips party when my house is so mossy. No problem. We'll get rid of it. It grew back. That's just what happened at the farm. Okay, new plan. Let's have the party outside, 
We'll tidy up the moss later. Great thinking. We can keep the moss from spreading by closing all the doors and windows. Quick, B. Close the door. Problem solved. Now we can have our nibbles and sips party outside. Yep, that moss isn't going... problem is now a big moss problem, and we're going to need some help to stop it. Some witch help. Cumulo! Oh. Hi, Cumulo. Please take us to the wishing tree. Faster! The moss is spreading! Hurry! Very good. Oh, greetings, Truman Bartleby. Hi, Z. What are you doing? <laughs> We're practicing balancing. Gotcha. <laughs> Thanks, wishes. We will work on this more later. What can I help you with, True? I'm hosting a Nibbles and Sips juice party for the king today. But I have a big Zazuni moss problem, and it seems to be getting bigger. Quarks and quasars, is it ever? Moss is spreading all over Rainbow City. All right, let's stop and have a think. <sighs> Looks like the moss is a big problem. What were you thinking, True? Well, Bartleby brought some moss back from Happy Farming Valley, and it's growing really fast. But it's so soft. <laughs> <laughs> I need some wishes to help me stop the moss from growing and spreading everywhere. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Can you show me what their powers are? I certainly can. Let us see. Ah, yes, here it is. Whoosh is the name of your windy wish. It has respiration super capacity. Huh? That means he sucks in and blows out really strongly. <laughs> I think there's gonna be a lot of moss to blow away. What's next? Where is... <laughs> Chilzy is a wish that can freeze things in ice. Perfect. I could freeze the moss to stop it from growing. Great idea. We'll make mossicles. <laughs> <laughs> Your last wish is twisty. It can twist things in all sorts of different ways. <laughs> I have no idea how Twisty will slow down the moss, but I'll think of something. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Bye, Z. Thanks for all your help. Bye. <laughs> Splendid work, Rainbow Guard. My scepter is as shiny as a star now. I'm ready to go to True's house for the nibbles and sips party. Mm -hmm. <gasps> a wall of moss? I don't think it's moss season. I can't get through it. Can you try? <laughs> Purple petunias, what a predicament. Mm. Oh no! It's getting worse. If we don't stop this fast, the rainbow can't 
kingdom will turn into the Zazuni Moss Kingdom. Mm -hmm. Oh, terrible thing a Zazuni Moss Kingdom would be. Bartleby, you've seen what's going on around here, right? I know. I'm just gonna miss it so much. Oh, Bartleby, time to get this mossy problem under control. And blow the moss away? Mm-hmm. <laughs> hmm. Whoosh, try harder. I know you can do it. Uh -huh. Whoa, wow. <laughs> Hold on. When you inhaled, the moss ripped off and went right into your mouth. Can you inhale the rest of it? Mm-hmm. <laughs> power of a super vacuum. Great job, Woosh. Now for the inside. The inside, too? Bartleby. <sighs> okay. After you. forget how soft you were. So very soft. I'll get you something just as soft to sleep on. Promise? Pa promise. Okay, but I don't think you'll find anything softer than super comfy soft Suzuni. <gasps> it already reached the Rainbow Castle. Can you hold any more moss? <laughs> Thanks for helping, Loosh. I'll be back to get you after you digest and get smaller again. But right now, it's time for some freezing action. Cumulo! We have to hurry to stop this moss. Okay, Chilzy, come on out. It's about to get icy. Ha! Huh. Good thing I have built-in mittens. Oh. Hey! <laughs> Do you really think Chilsey can freeze all of this? We have to try. Time to freeze some moss. <laughs> 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 it's working. The moss stopped growing. Let's keep going. Chilzy did it. Everything's frozen. And now the rainbow castle. I thought I wasn't going to make it to your nibbles and sips party today. We had a bit of a Zazuni moss problem, Your Majesty. But we stopped it from growing. Once we get it all shoveled up, it's nibbles and sips for all. Yay! And look! The weather couldn't be better for it. All warm and sunny. 
Warm? And sunny? I've got a soggy, sinking feeling about this troop. What? Oh, oh, I should have left that piece of moss back on Zazuni Moss Island. I'm sorry, True. I did this. It's all my fault. It's okay, Bartleby. We'll get things back to normal with my last wish. Twisty the Twist Wish. How can twisting stop the moss from mossing? All that wish does is twist, twist, twist. I feel like we've seen twisting like this before. But where? I twisted dough into pretzels yesterday for lunch. They were delicious. Yum. Oh, wow. <laughs> really good. And I twisted a balloon into a balloon mouse for you this morning. I love that balloon mouse. Um, while it lasted. And the juicer we saw at Mosser's farm, it had a funnel that twisted the moss and made the juice. Wait a minute. Bartleby, that's it. Twisting turns Zazuni moss into Zazuni juice. The moss is gone and only juice is left. Sounds like a great plan. If anyone can get rid of this moss, it's you, true. Thanks, Rainbow King. Ready, B? Always. Except for when I'm napping. But I'm not, so yes! <laughs> Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Twisty! Wish come true! Okay, Twisty, let's Twisty twist the moss and make it go away! <laughs> Rodeo rainbows! That's great! Thanks, Drew! My pleasure, Your Majesty. Let's go, B. Fishy poof crackers. <laughs> okay, Twisty and Woosh, back in the pack. Cherry Jubilee, true. These nibbles and sips are superb. Thank you, Your Highness. And best of all, there's no moss left in the Rainbow Kingdom. Here, here. <sighs> Bartleby. I haven't forgotten my paw promise. I knew you wouldn't. I got you a new pillow to nap on that's just as soft as moss. <gasps> Aw, thanks, True. But there's no way a pillow could be as soft as... <laughs> <laughs> Sweet dreams, B. <sighs> Zappy Cling. Don't be shy. Come on out. Oh, look at you. So warm and glowy. I love hugging wishes. And we love getting hugs, especially from you, True. Mm. Affection makes wishes happier and stronger. It's good for them. You know so much about the wishes, Z. I really enjoy studying them. I learn something new from the wishes every day. Everyone knows wishes are cool, but these tools are amazing! They are amazing! Like this one. And this one. And this one. And this one's super cool. Ooh, and I know what this is for. Ninja Cat Go! Ha, ha, ha! Ninja Cat Power! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Careful, that zingy zapper has many uses. I'm still learning to master them myself. Still learning, got it. Ow. 
The zingy zapper contains powerful zappy cling energy. It makes wishes cling to it, like this. Wawa, waza, whim. I use it when I need to move many wishes at once. Wawa, waza, whim. Cool! C can I try? Please? Yeah, okay. Can I? Hmm. Please? I'm sorry, Bartleby, but the zingy zapper is far too powerful to be used as a toy. Oh. Okay. But there is something you could do to help me. A wish named Heidi is hiding in my study. Could you please find it for me and bring it back? You betcha! Wish finder Bartleby is on the job! Heidi! I know you're in here somewhere. Come out, come out, you adorable little lighter, you. Aw, there you are, Heidi. Uh -huh. huh? What? <laughs> what? No, oh, where is it? Where is it? Huh. I know what I can use to find you. <laughs> the coolest wish catcher around! What does Z say again to make it work? Um, Wooly Woonga Wah? Hmm, Wally Winga Woo? Wiggle Wumble Wee? Walla Was a Whim? What? Huh? I'll just leave that zingy zappy thing alone from now on. Forever. Huh? Oh. Hey! Oh! oh. <laughs> I spy with my kitten eye. <laughs> Hi, Z! <laughs> Bartleby, are you all right? I heard some ninja sounds, then a zap, then a crash, then a scream. Oh, <laughs> Hi, True. I was just uh, looking through some of Z's notes, and I found Hi, Z. Um, uh, he's just back there at the table. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a notebook? Hmm. Huh? Oh, yes. I'm making notes. Wish notes. All about the interesting things Z told us about the wishes today. And I can't wait to read them at home. Which we really should get back to. Don't you think? I mean, right now? Hmm. Try out this new wish hammock. <laughs> Great stuff, Z. Gotta go. Can't stand around here all day. Let's go, True. Bye, Z. Bye. I think he's ready to go home. Bye, Z. Bye, True. See you later. Hmm. My zingy zapper? On the floor? Strange. <laughs> Hi, Z. There you are. <laughs> Let's get you back to the other wishes. Everything okay, B? I've never seen you so super energized to get home. Energized? What? Wait, no. Uh, well, I was just... You know, I couldn't wait to read my notes from our visit with Z. Why don't you take a break? We can play a game downstairs. Great. I'll be right down. Oh, no. <laughs> this is not... <sighs> Oh, no. I'm cling from me already! What's all that stuff you're ringing down, B? Huh? Oh, you wanted to play games, right? Well, this is my game stool and my game pillow to, um, game with! Perfect. Your pillow can be one of the dum-dum-dum lava islands. The whole floor is lava. We can't touch it. And these islands are the only safe place to walk. My island's good right here. No, it's not. You're sinking into the lava. Quick, be quick. <gasps> oh, oh. Ew, comfy. Whoopsie. Oh, cushy. Oh, oh. Poofy, squishy. Ow. <laughs> Bartleby, the pillows are for the game. No, stop. You'll cling to me, too. 
Everything is clinging to me! Aw, my poor little buddy. It's okay, stay calm. You got it, staying calm, no problem, cool as a cucumber. <laughs> Less cool, warming up! Uh-oh, we'd better get you outside before everything in the house sticks to you. Just walk nice and steady, and don't touch anything. <clears throat> yeah, you mean walk like a cat ninja. I'm an expert at that. <laughs> oh, boy. Whoa! Whoa! whoa. <laughs> hey, can't go for a walk without boots on, right? <laughs> okay, I think I'm stuck now. Ah! Whoa! Ooh, sorry. I forgot how clingy you were. Oh, look at me! I used to be a cat, now I'm a cat ball! A giant cat ball of everything! We'll fix this. Just follow me, walking nice and steady. I can't do steady! All I can do is roly-poly with too much roly. And now's Billy! Hmm. Maybe I can roll you and... No, 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 no! You can't touch me or you'll get stuck! Oh, right. No touching. What a sticky situation. Maybe Z can help. Cumulo, over here! Hi, Cumulo. We need to get Bartleby to the wishing tree fast to see Z. Can you roll yourself onto Cumulo, B? <coughs> Big Noli on the rolly. Hmm. How are we going to get you to the wishing tree? I'm true. Don't worry, B. I'll think of a way. I just have to. <gasps> Bartleby, stop! Oh, yeah! <gasps> oh, follow that cat ball. So maybe you can help. <laughs> Look out! Catch me! Phew! Yeah! That was a close one. Sorry, my bad. Clingy cat. Now I'm a little sticky today. Bartleby's getting bigger by the second. There's no way I can get him to the wishing tree now. I need some wish help. Let's go, Cumulo! Problem too. My zingy zapper has lost all its zappy cling, and I can't find Hyde Z anywhere. I need some help. Where's Wishfinder Bartleby? He's not here. He's in trouble. What happened? He's like a big ball of stuff now, and he's getting bigger. Everything he touches clings to him. Great gravity. Let's sit and have a think about this. <gasps> How can the wishing tree help you? Well, first I need a wish that can help me catch the Bartleby ball. Then, I need a wish that can uncling all the things that are clinging to him. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Excellent wishes, True. Let's see what else we can learn about them. Oh, Wishopedia!
Your first wish is Elongi. It's a wish that can stretch out super long, but can also snap back into shape. Elongi hmm. is super rubbery. That could help me catch the Bartleby ball. I'm eager to hear the results. Now, where is your second wish? Ah, Glue Boo. It is a sticky wish that can make anything stick to its glue trail, no matter what the object is made of. That's kind of gross, but you can help me pull everything off Bartleby. And your third wish is Zizu. This wish is like a battery that can take and give energy. Hmm, I'm not sure how a battery can help me stop Bartleby, but I'm sure I'll find a way. Thanks, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Let's go save my best friend. Gotta run. Good luck, True. Are you come for your majesty? Do you have enough nibbles and sips? Oh, yes. Quite delicious. Now, what's this surprise you have for me? <laughs> Just some must-see entertainment for your next royal event. Now, for the first time anywhere, I present the amazing acrobatic feats of Griselda's Grismos! With music by me, Griselda. Not bad. <laughs> Too big to hide. <gasps> I found you. I'm coming, Bartleby. Oh, wonderful! Wonderful! And now for the big finish, a pyramid of Grismos. Got more coming through! Oh, hello, Bartleby. Would you care for some nibbles? Yes, please. All this rolling is making me hungry. My nibbles! Up, oh, away I go. My fruity kings! Grab the king yourself and don't let that Bartleby boat touch you! Help, <laughs> true! Time for my first wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Alongi! What wish come true? Okay, Alongi, let's play catch with Bartleby. <laughs> We stopped? We stopped! Finally, things are looking up! I spoke too soon. Including True and Bartleby in the show? Genius. I know. Hmm. That's not exactly how I thought you'd stop him from rolling, but it worked. <laughs> Thanks, Alongi. Oh. Now back in the pack. Wait! Stop! Don't touch the Bartleby ball or you'll cling to mm -hmm. it too! <laughs> you just couldn't resist, could you? No, you couldn't. Don't worry. Now that we've stopped it, I have a way to unstick everything from the ball. Glue Boo, I need you. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Glue Boo. Wish come true. Are you ready, Glue Boo? It's time to roll out and get sticky! <laughs> Can you guys help pull the Bartleby ball towards Glue Boo without touching it? <laughs> With 
Would you do the honors, Rainbow Cake? Brilliant. Blue, I'd be happy to. Okay, now. One. Two. Three. This is definitely over. You can let go now, B. I'm trying! <gasps> Uh-oh. <gasps> this is bad, Drew! Bad! Not because it's you, I love you. But this is bad! Huh? Oh no! They're still full of zappy cling energy! Oh, oh my! <laughs> Much better. <laughs> What's happening outside? All of this sappy kind energy reminds me of something. The zingy zapper. What's happening? Flying photons! That ball's humongous! Rizzy! <gasps> True! What's happening? I couldn't get rid of the ball zappy coin energy! It looks like everything in the kingdom was stuck to the ball, including you! <gasps> the wishing tree! Fluorescent fuchsia! The ball sappy cling has gotten so strong, it will take all the power from the wishing tree. That would spell disaster for the entire Rainbow Kingdom. See, I know what's causing this. It has to be your zingy zapper. It can't be. The staff's not working. It has no charge at all. Oh, yeah. How about that? Remember how you said I shouldn't use your zingy zapper? Well, it kind of did. And it kind of filled me with zappy cling energy. And ever since then, everything in the kingdom has kind of stuck to me. <laughs> Woo! Feels good to say that, really does. No! Stay back, or you'll get clingy too! My zing zapper! What do we do now? I still have my third wish, Zizu. But how can I use it to fix this? I need a moment to think. We'll be right back. Zappy Kling energy is what's holding the Bartleby ball together. <gasps> I have an idea. Zizu can pull the energy from the Bartleby ball and give it back to the Zingy Zapper. Then the Bartleby ball will fall apart and we'll be free. Brilliant idea, Drew. You really are a magical creature. I've always thought that. Okay, Zizu, let's do this. Zip Zap Zoo, I choose you. Zizu. Wish come true! Hi, Zizu. Are you ready to get fully charged? <laughs> Great. I need you to charge up on all the zappy cling energy from the Bartleby ball. Ah. <laughs> You're doing great, Zizu. Let's put the zappy cling energy back where it belongs. Get ready, Zizu! <laughs> now! <laughs> I think it worked! <laughs> Here you go. Sorry about your zingy zapper. Rapture! 
Great job, you two. Thank you. Everything is back to the way it was before. Thanks to you, True. You're welcome, Rainbow King. <laughs> and my zingy zapper is working better than ever. No way am I goofing around with that thing anymore. Or with any of your other gadgets ever, ever again. <laughs> Bartleby, I thought you had enough of clinging today. Oh, yeah, but that was before. This is now. Cat cuddles. <gasps> Clingy check. Um, B? Clingy check. Yep, I'm still good. But I'll always be stuck on you, True. 